So Panzer Dogs, in my opinion, is a hidden gem on Sui, and let me tell you more about it. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Trevin, or Trevin vs. NFT, and I'm that Sui guy. The main reason I actually wanted to join Sui in the first part was actually because I had gaming and the potential to actually get involved in esports. I've always been an avid gamer of Web3 and gaming, and honestly, Panzer Dogs makes the perfect fit for that. And the crazy part is they actually started on Solana and they were early adopters and moving over to Sui when it was first starting out. And just so everyone was aware, Sui mainnet dropped in May, so the chain hasn't been out for even a year yet. And the best part is the game is simple and fun. So let's talk a little bit more about Panzer Dogs and how easy it is to get started. So the best part is they actually have two versions. So you can play on your desktop or on your mobile. And this is perfect so cool. because I feel like a lot of people sleep on casual gamers. A lot of people grew up in my generation of playing Clash of Clans and just playing with their friends. Well, this is the game for you then. It's very easy to get started and it literally takes under a minute to sign up. You can play with your friends if you invite them with a the code and you can level up your tank more and more and more to become the ultimate tank boss and destroy everyone in your path. A little bit more fun thing is that when you actually create your account, you're creating a Sui wallet. So what this does is it actually introduces people to the Sui blockchain without even knowing it. And yes, this might seem a little sneaky, but actually in a good way, you're exposing more amazing Web3 games to casual gamers. And if you call something a digital collectible instead of an NFT, it sounds a lot better. The best part is we actually talked about this on a space when I had Panzer Dogs and myself talking about what their go-to for strategy is when talking about the word NFT. A lot of people have a terrible idea of what it is because for the most part, everyone has been scamming people and doing rug pulls with NFTs. So it's hard to actually understand what people want. And the best part is when you explain it that it's a digital collectible and you're actually able to sell this possibly on a secondary market, everyone's eyes light up. And also it's really cool because basically they have three different game modes. The first game mode is Team Deathmatch, second one is Escort, and last but not least, we have King of the Hill. And the cool thing is you're actually able to stake your Panzer Dogs and earn Koban later on, which will be their native token of Lucky Cat. The thing I like about Panzer Dog so much is they make it simple and easy to play. I feel like that's a big part of Web3 Gaming that not a lot of companies have kind of understood. So to have a platform where you're actually able to play on desktop and mobile, just like I mentioned, is a slam dunk to onboard gamers into Web3 and also Sui. To top it all off, Unchained Esports, myself, and Panzer Dogs will actually be doing a whitelist tournament. So this will basically be the biggest tournament that Panzer Dogs has ever done. I know down the line they want to do future tournaments and I want to work with them more and more. The best part is all you got to do is play their game, get on the leaderboard, and you can possibly get whitelist for my project. Other than that, Panzer Dogs, in my opinion, is still a hidden gem and not enough people know about it. The best part is their NFTs are also over 100 Sui. At the making of this video, Sui is at $1.40. It's been a crazy run. And personally, I'm happy to say I own five of their digital collectibles. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and definitely check out Panzer Dogs. It's super fun. And the best part is if you sign up, it takes under one minute and you can actually sign up with multiple different accounts. And probably my favorite part about this before the video does end, you're able to sign up with email, Twitter, Discord, Google, or even Apple. This is what I'm talking about to onboard the next generation into Web3 Gaming. My name is Trevin or Trevin versus NFT, and I will see you in Web3.